Congratulations. I feel like oh, this gum is in my mouth. Sorry. Um, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I feel like this has been in the makings for a very long time. Why now? Live Size 2, we have had four scripts. And we kept doing it over and over. And I would give pages and pages of notes. And I do my notes like physically, like writing on the page. And then the network would go, no. And then we do another script and another. And finally we realized that Eve needs to grow up. That her audience was girls between seven and like 13. And now they're older and they're women now. And so we need to reflect what they're experiencing in their life. And Eve needs to reflect that. So it's a whole new edgy, modern Eve coming to Life Size 2. What kind of edgy things is she going through now? You know what? I don't really know. The writer is doing some crazy stuff right now. She pitched it to me and I was like, <laughs> okay. All I can say is, okay. And now I'm going to get some hate mail from some moms thinking that they're going to watch, you know, Life Size with their five-year-old. And this is free form. <laughs> it's not Disney Channel. Yes. Was that a part of your choice too when you guys decided to go older to move to Freeform? Um, it was the other way around. We said let's go to Freeform and now it makes sense to make her older. Yes. Absolutely. What about other original cast members? I know everyone's asking, but anyone? I would love for, I would love for Lindsay Lohan to do something. Like I bonded with her actually on set. We lived together pr practically for like six weeks. Me and her little brother who's now a model and her sister <laughs> and her mama and like we were hanging for six weeks in Canada, and in Vancouver. And so I, I love Lindsay. Everything she's gone through, I see her, and I'm like, that's still my little baby. So like, I really hope that she can come back and do something. I think people would be very happy to see that moment, just a moment at least. Yeah, for sure. Um, and is it, in the, it's at the holidays it's coming out? Around the holiday 2018, Life Size 2. Okay, cool. Um, I also have to ask about Top Model, because you're coming back, and I'm really excited. Why did you decide to come back? So I thought I could move on because like I tend to like to move on from things. Like I did five years of my talk show. I moved on. I did 10 years of Victoria's Secret and modeled since I was 15 years old. I retired big time on national TV, Kiss the V Scepter, <laughs> moved on. Uh, and I thought America's Next Top Model, same thing. However, this little thing called social media <laughs> exists now. And the fans of Top Model and my fans were like, oh no, you don't, bitch. Like, it was kind of like harsh, but like like that tough love. And so I had to look at that from like a fan kind of standpoint and then a business standpoint. And I want the brand to continue. I want, I want Top Model to be like the Jeopardy of reality TV. <laughs> you know, like Jeopardy of game shows is just around forever. And so in order for that, I realized I needed to come back to sustain the brand, so I did. As someone who was Victoria's Secret model back before it was what it is now, yeah. Um, how do you feel about like the world of models now? It's a whole different, a whole different thing. There's so, like yes. you said, social media and reality TV and everything. Well, what I love about modeling now is that it's a bit more inclusive. Like we have Ashley Graham, who's a supermodel, and in my day we had a couple of models that were plus size or what I call fiercely real, but they weren't like super duper famous. So that's great. We have girls on Instagram. I say if you have a camera phone, you're a model. You know, so it's really like opened that up. And I think Top Model has something to do with that because over the course of 15, 16 years, we've said you don't have to be a cookie cutter to be beautiful. And now people have the access to actually take a picture of their non-cookie cutter beauty and show it to the world. So I actually love what's happening right now with um, modeling.